Hey guys, welcome to a brand new YouTube video. Today guys, we are going to be talking about The Evil Within 3. I've played both The Evil Within 1 and 2. I think they're great games in its entirety, and I prefer the second one over the first one, like a lot of people do. I think the second one is just a far better game and a worthy sequel. Now, I love these two games in its entirety, so I thought maybe, hey, the evil within three isn't that long away maybe a couple years at most but um we're gonna be talking about some leaks and news and some rumors regarding the game you do enjoy this video guys can you guys please do me a favor drop a like subscribe if you guys are new and without further ado let's just get right into this oh yeah one more thing guys before i do continue on i apologize for the lack of videos i just haven't really been feeling it and i'm not gonna force myself to push out the content when i don't feel it but that's why i'm making an easier video for you guys today no flashy editing nothing crazy just commentary and i'm gonna have some pictures of what i'm talking about and detailing on the screen for you guys and i will return to making resident evil content relatively soon and I thought it would just be easier to make this kind of video. And again, I do want to explore other sort of content here on YouTube. I don't want to limit myself just to Resident Evil because that's just not the type of person I am. Alright guys, so here's all the information we currently know about The Evil Within 3. Following 2017's The Evil Within 2 launch, Tango Gameworks started work on The Evil Within 3, but that became its own IP, which later was revealed to be Ghostwire Tokyo, which is coming out this month. I don't know if it's out at the current time of this recording, but it is going to be out this month. Now, The Evil Within IP is still re-registered for continued use by Bethesda. Now, The Evil Within 2 didn't sell-wise uh, physical sales, so it's understandable why they didn't want to push out another game. They wanted to take a break and, you know, let their creative minds free. John Johannes, the director of The Evil Within 2, is currently going to be directing a new game by Tango Software that is currently not titled yet. And it has to be The Evil Within 3, man. I mean, Tango Software hasn't really posted any other type of games. And I'm pretty sure they want to make a trilogy. If I'm being quite honest, a trilogy doesn't sound like a bad idea to end off this series. And then maybe in a couple years or maybe down the line, if it's on Bethesda and Tango Software's mind that they want to continue this franchise, by all means, it's a really good slate to leave off at. Or if another developer want to pick up the IP, by all means, I can just see that Tango Software leaves the leaves the franchise with a trilogy that could end it off really nicely and tie up the story. You know, a third entry must be set in stone at this point. I mean, the assets for Ghost War Tokyo were uh, originally The Evil Within Three. I'm pretty sure they have a story for The Evil Within at the The Evil Within Three at this point. Um, but it, time will tell, man. Time will tell. You know, we might not get a new game for a couple years, but in time we will get more leaks and information. And as soon as that does come, I will let you guys know. But other than that, guys, that's pretty much going to have to wrap up today's video. I hope you guys definitely did enjoy, and I will catch you guys in the next video. Thank you guys so much for watching.